So over the years, I've done various small snippets of business training, um, but nothing as intense as a leadership training course. So am I doing it correctly? Um, I often think to it of like the going to the gym and I just jump on all the equipment, have a go at this, have a go at that, and have a go at the other, and think I'm getting fit. But actually, I'm probably using it all in the wrong sequence for the wrong length of time. So what I needed to do was to know exactly how I'm supposed to be doing it. After engaging with Mark, um, I didn't commit straight away and I did say that I'm not going to commit to it. I want to know more about it. So I wanted to know that it covered all levels of training. It wasn't just about putting me on track. It was setting everything right. So in my personal life, uh, not just my business life, because my business life is probably bigger than my personal life. Well, the, the biggest problem uh, was time and the constant, not enough time to do this, not enough time to do that. Whereas what I could see I could gain from the program was getting my time back. So actually time become my best friend rather than my worst enemy. Um, and I soon found that I had spare time. I had focus time. I had time for development. I had time to focus on the actual business, which I wasn't putting aside before. So that, that, was, that was absolute key. The planning uh, of it all, um, long-term planning, uh, setting up uh, goals that I've got to achieve, setting up uh, methods of achievement, sorry, of, of measurement to achieve them goals. So you could see when you were achieving them and when you needed to adjust them, when you needed to give it a bit more time, whether you gained a bit more time, but it made you actually do it. And likewise, everything else fell into place because you could do anything if you put your mind to it. I'm being honest with you now. I don't think I'd be here in business now if it wasn't for doing what I did when COVID hit. Because when COVID hit, I was in a real good, strong place. And, and I absolutely smashed it. We've come out of this better, a better business than we were before, much stronger. Uh, we've made all the cutbacks that we needed to do. Um, it, it, everything's more accountable. The staff are now more understanding. So my next goal is to, to work with them really, to, for them to do the same sort of things really. Concentrating on high payoffs, and the high payoffs is what is, is why the business is surviving. So I've got to do those things. The imperative side of things, they've got to be done. I signed every single invoice off. I don't need to do that. I need to sign off and see invoices that aren't correct, that are out of the ordinary. And I've done that. It's given me four and a half hours a week back uh, through my able to do that. So there's, what I did was streamlined it all. We ended up creating an extra column on things that we wouldn't have thought of doing before. We've actually cut the staff down because of that. Um, the company is more efficient. We can do things quicker. And our overheads are down absolutely massively. I mean, I've told you the figures, it's, it's astronomical what they've come down. The thing is, is, when I come through that door every day, I set the, the tone, I set the mood for how everybody's day is going to be, how the business is going to be. So I come in happy, we're all happy. I come in miserable, we're all miserable. So that was something that had to be addressed straight away. And that was an instant change. Instantly, literally within a week, um, I picked it up. Um, obviously with COVID, I had a long time to practice it as well. Um, but it, it brought it all back into line. So the staff actually benefited from it. You know, these are my work colleagues of 20 years, some of them. So they want to see me happy. I want to work with happy people, but it all needs to start off right. So I don't tell somebody I want something doing and I want it done by a certain time. I tell somebody what I want to achieve and how I'd like to achieve it. And I give them input into it and I give them ownership of it. So now I recognise the different people. What I liked was the, the, the timing of it, because I've done others before where I've had a two, three hour lesson, and then I've ended up with sort of 50 hours 
of homework to do and it's all based on what I remember. Whereas this is completely structured and there's things to pick you up on the way and you can measure where you're getting to. There's also what I like is the fact that I can go back and redo things which I have done so I can reevaluate it.